Hey guys, this is Jennifer with The Wiki Natural. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you three, three different locking, I mean retwisting gels to see which one works the best, so stay tuned. Okay, I'm back. Um, this is fairly new to me because all during through my lock journey, I've been locked for about a year and a couple of months that I have been doing reties, which is interlocking. So what I decided to do was split my hair, switch from that for give my hair interlocking a break for a little bit and just try out this retwist thing and I know you're not supposed to go back and forth between retwist and interlocking but I'm going to try it because um, I'm going to try it because my hair is doing okay it's just that it is thinning a little bit and um, I just want to try it because I just want to see how the retwist does. In between the time that I'm going to retie, I retie every couple of months. Not a couple of months, like eight weeks. And my dog is barking. It's like two o'clock in the morning, you guys. And yeah, it's like 2 o'clock, and I do not know why that fool is barking. He went outside and let him out. I just don't understand what his problem is. But anyway, getting back to the subject. So, I'm, I'm going to spray my hair with my little oil, oil mixture that I have. I can't talk because it's very late. And I'm just going to try... A few strands in the front to see which one I like the best which format which type of gel I like the best so I know they say never to retwist your hair dry so my hair has been washed a couple of days ago and so I wanted to do it before then but I didn't get a chance to because I've just been busy I'm trying to do a project in my house. I'll probably do a video on that. Um, doing a little project in my home over the break. And so, over this winter break. And so I am trying to get that done and still keep my schedule for these videos. So the first product up is this Lock It Up. And I'm just putting about this much uh, Talia YG's products, you know, I'm just probably putting too much on there. Just need a little bit, I guess. So I'm just going to twist. And twist it around like that. And her products are one of the first products I encountered as a natural. And so her products are geared for natural. They've always been no sulfates. This has no um, no alcohol in it. And she's just always been a go-to black woman owned type company that's been lock friendly from the very beginning, like late 90s found out about her in the late 90s so I'm going to try another lock with this formulation on it so it's called lock it up and a lot of people swear by this and I had some I don't know why I still had some probably because I used to use it for something probably to twist twist my hair back in the day um, twist my 
to twist my natural hair, my loose hair, into two strand twists back in the day. And then of course we wanna go away from the tried and, tried and true type deals. So this is what it looks like, you guys, on the inside. And like I said, I only did a little bit. And I'm not a pro at this by any means. I'm used to interlocking. So that's my few locks with that. I'm not gonna I'm gonna go through and do my whole head, but I'm just gonna demonstrate with three different products. I know. So I did a few with that lock it up. Get a little closer. It does leave a little, looks like a little something in your hair. Which I really don't like. Okay. Next up is gonna be probably the most expensive option, which is this. It's also Talia YG. It's the apple and apple and aloe with coconut. And this is what it looks like on the inside, you guys. So, I'll put some on my hand because you can't really see it on the camera. That's what it looks like. Again, I'm going to spray this area. And I'll show you tomorrow what it looks like. I'm gonna go to bed. I just been itching to do this video and I couldn't wait. A little messy with this. Ooh, I guess. This has a more jelly. The other one felt like um, a gel. This feels more like a gel cream. That makes sense. natural option if you don't want any product build up this is looser than all the others so it's more like very watery consistency so I can see myself doing doing my twist outs with this I mean twist outs my retwist with this. And obviously, I don't care which way I retwist, obviously, because I just did it two different ways. Okay, so there you have it.
the retwist. I mean, this has been a minute because I actually did go back to interlocking because I'm so lazy. Did I, did I say that? <laughs> it just seems to take less time and less effort to interlock. Meaning once I've done it, it's done. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to worry about it unraveling or anything like that. But be that as it may, um, if I were to retwist my hair on a regular basis, um, I feel like the best product for the job, my number one product for the job, would be this Talia Waji Lock It Up. And it's really kind of a toss up between these two things, but this, um, I felt, had a little bit more hold to it. Um, this was good too. However, um, this can be, this has, this has many uses. This is a multi-purpose type product. And um, I think that this could be used in many applications. So if you have this at home and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money, this would be a great second option. This is typically about $7.99 to $8.99 in your beauty supply store. So this is good too. Um, as far as product buildup, this will have the least amount of product buildup, but this is juicier. So this has, this will stay in your hair, I think a little longer, but because it's aloe, I think that'll be okay. Um, that will be okay. Um, this product I found was a little too white, um, meaning the product itself is, is a white Gel. So for applications for locks, um, I'm not really convinced that this is a great idea because of the whiteness of the gel and the, the ability to leave a little product build up. And so this is what I did with this. What I did was this, with this is get this to my daughter to use because she's a loose natural. And this is great for curl definition, okay? So this is not necessarily good for locked hair, but I find that it smells amazing and it will be great for a loose natural to use on their hair, okay? And of course, there are many YouTubers that have talked and gave their praises to this particular Apple and aloe gel, which is the reason why I decided to try it on my locked hair because it was a great application for natural hair. But for our locked ladies, these would be a better choice. Um, I picked this because I don't really like how aloe vera smells in its natural state. I'm a little picky, it's really sticky and gummy. And so this would be a good option for those who don't like that. Um, that sticky, gooey type feeling. And um, I, I just stand by this because this is a tried and true OG product. And so I would definitely go with this. So until next time, that is my final thoughts on these. And um, I'll be doing some other products that have worked with my hair. So stay tuned for that. And of course, if you like this content and you think you would like to see more of this content, please let me know in the comments. Um, below. And until next time, stay wookie.